Are you interested in beautiful resort style living that just screams Florida? Hi, I'm Lori Hodges with Homes by Hodges and Keller Williams, and this is Luca, and we're here in Evergreen. This neighborhood is completely family friendly and pet friendly and has a beautiful lake so that you can walk your pups around it. Let's go check it out. It was built and finished around 2006, and the developer was WCI at the time. Evergreen is located between A1A and Military Trail going east to west, and from Hood Road to Donald Ross Road going north to south. It has 963 homes, and this is made up of townhomes and single family homes. So some of the townhomes are quite large, they can be around 2,000 square feet, and the single family homes go anywhere from 1,600 feet to 4,500 feet. So the prices vary quite a bit. A lot of them have really nice preserve views, and uh, lake views and you have a good variety of the styles there's tuscan there's mediterranean there's french country um, so you have a little bit of variety which is nice one of the really nice things about this neighborhood is that it is uh, guard gated it has two manned gates they're there 24 7 with live people to check ids and they provide a lot of security so people like that there's also a separate exit an entrance without a man so you have to live here to use that entrance because there's a barcode on your car and that goes out to military trail so that's a third option to, depending on where you live in the neighborhood um, there is a massive lake in the middle of the community the lake is almost 37 acres it's called Lake Dorothy let's take a look It's really nice because there is a walking path all the way around the trail. So in the mornings, in the evenings, you see people running, you see people walking their dogs. Everyone's kind of out and about and they typically walk around the lake because it's such a nice, pretty view. You also have all of these very tall bird feeders. This is, I'm gonna read this to make sure I get it right. It was the first residential, um, development in the world to be named a signature sanctuary gold community by the Audubon International Society. <laughs> a lot of words, but basically it's an Audubon community, which means it is known for um, the wildlife, in particular, all the birds. There are cranes and um, herons that are three, four feet tall. They walk around, they stroll in the streets. They don't seem to mind the cars or the kids riding their bikes um, they just walk very slowly so you have to be careful and the neighborhood is very dimly lit in the evenings and that helps to keep the birds here supposedly that's one of the reasons why it is dimly lit because um, the birds don't like all those harsh lights so the birds here are really amazing The HOA fees in Evergreen are actually really reasonable. They're under $500 per month, and that includes your man-gated security, um, your basic cable, all your access to the clubhouse, the fitness center, the resort, the resort, the resort style pool and clubhouse. Um, and that's really good. Northern Palm County, there are very few places under $500 a month for the HOA fees that include a man-gated guard gate. So a lot of communities have keypad entrances and barcode stickers, but very few of them have a manned gate for under $500 a month. There is no membership fee when you join. Um, this is 2022 and there's a capital contribution of around $1,500 when you buy, which is going to their reserves and maintenance and things like that. But the HOA fee is actually really reasonable and it's one of the reasons why people like Evergreen. So behind me is the beautiful Clubhouse of Evergreen. It is over 20,000 square feet. It has a beautiful pool. It's one of the largest in the area. It has um, a community room that people rent out for wedding receptions and parties. It seats over 100 people, I believe. It has an aerobics room that they use for yoga, weight room, um, a kid's play area, a great splash pad. So let's go take a look at that.
Here is the sand volleyball court and the beach area. So you can pull up a chair, hang out by the lake, or play some volleyball. This beautiful pier extends out into Lake Dorothy, which is really nice. And sometimes you'll see events. So you can reserve the pier. People can do receptions or parties on the pier. And it's a beautiful location for that. These are some of the larger homes in the neighborhood. neighborhood actually got a bad rap for a few years because when it was developed it was that crazy time of building where things were built with Chinese drywall and there were some homes in this neighborhood that were built with Chinese drywall so don't be alarmed if you're doing a Google search and something comes up about that but it was a very long time ago and all of those homes have been remediated and it has been a you know another 15 years since all of that happened and so there is no more Chinese drywall in this neighborhood all the homes um, that had it were uh, redone with the correct drywall, just so you know. And here is the full-size basketball court. And here are the beautiful tennis and pickleball courts. And here is the full-length bocce ball court. They really keep everything in very good condition here. Well, that wraps up our tour of the Evergreen community in Palm Beach Gardens. If you've got questions about this neighborhood or any others in Jupiter or the Palm Beaches, my team would love to help you. Again, this is Lori Hodges with Homes by Hodges, and we're making Realty Dreams a reality. Bye, friends.